so I'm getting ready to take you guys to one of my favorite places in Central Park. Right over here. So, I kind of love this park. I've been going here since I was a little kid. Clears my mind. Hoping to do that right now. It's got something to talk about. Okay, so when I was little, I used to run down these steps right here and I will pretend that that spot right there led to a magical place of course that's what little fucking kids do excuse my language <laughs> so walk through Central Park I should I would tell you guys how to get to my spot but I think I'm gonna have to dub that situation right now Seriously though, there are like so many different secret ways in Central Park that it's kind of amazing that more people don't know about it. Oh well. Tip for next time I do this. Try not to come out on a rainy day. There are way too many puddles. We got another one coming right up. This is crazy. Okay, so I know everybody knows about this spot, but welcome to the hill. It's a lovely place. It's a nice little walkway. People play, eat lunch, have their dogs out, party, have music, all types of things. Late at night, you can see the people get drunk out here. Me and my friends used to do the same thing. Oh, look at all the birds. You see that one? Right there. So, from all of us. I kind of love this park. I've been going here since I was a little kid. It clears my mind. I'm hoping to do that right now. It's got something to talk about. Okay, so when I was little, I used to run down these steps right here. And I would pretend that that spot right there led to a magical place. Of course, that's what little fucking kids do. Excuse my language. <laughs> so, walk through Central Park. I should, I would tell you guys how to get to my spot, but I think I'm gonna have to dub that situation right now. Seriously though, there are like so many different secret ways in Central Park that it's kind of amazing that more people don't know about it. Oh well. Tip for next time I do this, try not to come out on a rainy day. There are way too many puddles. We got another one coming right up. This is crazy. Okay, so I know everybody knows about this spot, but welcome to the hill. It's a lovely place. It's a nice little walkway. People play, eat lunch, have their dogs out party, have music, all types of things. Late at night, you can see the people get drunk out here. Me and my friends used to do the same thing. Oh, look at all the birds. You see that one? Right there. Yes, it's somewhere around here, and no, it's nowhere around here. That's the beauty of a secret. Okay, so, um, please, try not to laugh. I might not be able to find my secret spot mainly because um yeah i'm not used to going this way to my secret spot let me be honest i'm used to traveling from the downtown area into the to the central park but since i live next to central park now i'm thinking like maybe i should go this way we have a secret okay so um please try not to laugh i might not be able to find my secret spot Mainly because, um, yeah, I'm not used to going this way to my secret spot. Let me be honest. I'm used to traveling from the downtown area into the to Central Park. But since I live next to Central Park now, I'm thinking, like, maybe I should go this way. <laughs> okay, so this is the place where I come to think. All right. So, look, 
sometimes you've got to go off the beaten path, the beaten journey, anyway. Like, look. This is a forbidden area. I don't much care about that. To be honest with you. I think this shit is beautiful. Anyway, the main reason I brought you guys out here, okay? Ugh. I'm in love with a girl and I shouldn't be. Not that I shouldn't be in love with a girl. Of course, love is subjective, but this, this seems to be my problem right here. I didn't know I could fall in love. Well, here's the thing. I'm not the type to admit this, but um... Alright, there's this girl... I, you know, I think it's better off if I, if I introduce you guys to her first. 